On June 28, 2023, a handover ceremony took place in Sexin, Poland, where 14 M1A1 Abrams tanks arrived at the harbor, marking a significant milestone in enhancing Poland's defense capabilities. The tanks were delivered as part of bilateral agreements between Poland and the United States, under the guidance of Minister of National Defense, Marius Blaskczak. Additionally, the delivery included three M88A2 Hercules technical support vehicles and spare parts. Poland's acquisition of a total of 116 M1A1 Abrams tanks, tailored to its specific requirements, is being carried out under a $1.4 billion contract. The contract also encompasses supplementary equipment, such as 12 M88A2 Hercules technical support vehicles, 8 M1074 joint assault bridge accompanying vehicles, 6 M577 command vehicles, and 26 NG second workshops. This acquisition follows Poland's procurement of 250 M1A2 SEPV. Three Abrams tanks in April 2022, with deliveries scheduled for 2025 to 2026, although the delivery dates for the first vehicles may potentially be accelerated. These tanks were acquired for a sum of $4.75 billion and were accompanied by supporting equipment, including 26 M88A2 Hercules technical support vehicles, 17 M1074 joint assault bridge accompanying vehicles, as well as a training and logistics package, and ammunition reserves. The arrival of the Abrams tanks in Sexin marks a significant milestone in Poland's ongoing efforts to modernize its military. The tanks will be incorporated into the inventory of the 18th Mechanized Division and the 19th Mechanized Brigade, and will be allocated to at least four battalions. In addition, in 2022, based on a separate agreement, the United States Army relocated 28 M1A2 SEPV.2 Abrams tanks to Polish territory along with instructors to train Polish crews, as part of the Abrams Academy established at the Land Forces Training Center in Potnan. Simultaneously, Poland is diversifying its tank fleet by acquiring K2 Black Panther tanks to fill the gaps resulting from the transfer of T-72 and PT-91 Tordy tanks to Ukraine. This strategic initiative involves receiving 180 newly produced K2 tanks, with future plans to procure 820 units of the K2 PL Polish variant starting in 2026. Poland's recent tank acquisition indicates its efforts to enhance its military capabilities, particularly in response to the recent Russian invasion of Ukraine. Poland maintains its dedication to assuming a regional leadership role within NATO and prioritizes enhancing crisis response capabilities, while addressing emerging security challenges. The M1A1 Abrams is a third-generation American main battle tank named after General Creighton Abrams. The tank is heavily armored and is designed for modern ground warfare. It is well known for its use by the United States Army and Marine Corps, but it has also been exported to other countries such as Australia, Egypt, Iraq, and Saudi Arabia. The M1A1 version of the Abrams tank, first produced in 1985, includes significant upgrades such as the M256 120mm smoothbore cannon, increased armor, and an improved suspension system. The Abrams M1A1 tank's reputation for survivability is a result of its advanced chopper armor, a composite blend of steel, ceramic, and other materials which provide superior protection against a variety of anti-tank projectiles. The M1A1 also features a sophisticated battle management system and a range of night vision and thermal imaging equipment, which provide a high degree of situational awareness. Despite its heavy armor and high power, the M1A1 Abrams is known for its speed and maneuverability on a variety of terrain types, a testament to its advanced turbine engine and hydrostatically driven transmission.